Hi everybody, this is my house. It is on Broadway Street. So over there is towards Glintop and Trafores. Over there is towards Pontypridd. And this is my house. And all these are mostly student houses and also the residents over here. So why did I choose this house? So this is why I chose private accommodation instead of university accommodation. Pontypridd is that direction and Sainsbury is that direction, Little is that direction, so that's where I get my groceries. Glintov is this direction, Trafor is this direction and it's really close by as well. And not to mention, they really helped me. So it is significantly nearer to Pontypridd and Sainsbury's and Little much more than if you stay in campus itself. That's why I chose this location. It's strategic, it's easy to get around. At the same time, it is significantly cheaper than university accommodation, including all bills as well. And you have like so much open space for yourself. So this is why I chose private accommodation instead of university accommodation. So this is my room, pardon the mess and everything. This room, it's all for me. It's a single bed and some rooms have double beds. That means it's all inclusive of water bills, electricity bills and gas bills. So that means for our heat things, for us, we don't have to worry because we can use it as much as we like. Especially during winter, that really helps if the cost is all in. So make sure you check with your landlord and everything to see whether your costs are in or whether you have to pay separately and that's the thing which is different from universities and private accommodation so make sure you check first before actually renting a room so my room has a bed it has a huge window it has a big desk for everything so usually i study on here with my laptop chairs um that's my storage space kind of that's where i put my luggage on top and that's where i hang my clothes and below my bed is actually all clothes as well so I actually have two storage spaces full of clothes like that I've got sockets over here I've got sockets over there as well and my landlord is totally okay of me putting that providing if I don't damage the walls and down here is where the toilets and my kitchen is at so the kitchen has a small table. We have two fridges. So this is a fridge. That's a fridge as well. This is a freezer. And we're sharing between four people. That's the sink. I have four hops and an oven. We have massive storage space. So that's a storage space, that's storage space, that's storage space. That's my storage space. Full of uh, food and dry stuff and some Malaysian tea. Yeah, man. We have a washing machine and this is our dryer this leads to the backyard so during the summer you can actually go and just chill over here and look at the skies and this is our bathroom We've got a long bath and also a shower so now this is the other toilet where it's a standing shower and there's a sink and everything so yeah that's my house and the thing is because you're staying with housemates that's why we actually have a rotor. So as you can see, so okay, let's say, whoop, let's say, okay, so Anna's doing 14th of January, I'm doing 21st of January, Marco's doing 28th of January. So we're actually cleaning the house, taking turns cleaning the house every single week so that everybody has a turn. So what we do is we clean the kitchen, we clean the bathrooms over there, we vacuum stuff, we vacuum our rooms and stuff like that. But, you know, everybody's rooms is their own, so we vacuum our own rooms, they vacuum their own rooms, do what they want with their own rooms. But for the living spaces, the living room, the bathroom, and the kitchen, we use the rotor system. And then during that week, we have to also, we also have to empty the rubbish bins and empty the food bins. So that is the thing that you have to really make sure if you're living in a private accommodation is to have agreements with you and your friends on who's doing this who's doing what and not cause big mess and have that make the whole living conditions tidy and just not offend everyone and you know live together amazingly as housemates <laughs> 